Good evening, everyone, and welcome to the newest Splatoon 2 update live stream. Just with the, just like we did with the Inkbrush live stream, we're coming at you live the moment that the newest Splatoon 2 update hits. If you're excited about these update live streams, then make sure to subscribe, turn on notifications, so that you don't miss these because we'll be doing them weekly. Whenever a new weapon, a new stage, anything comes out, we'll be at it the minute they release and trying it out. Here, 9 p.m. Central, we've got the Dually Squelchers. I cannot be more excited for them here. Uh, the Dually Squelchers combine the Jet Squelcher, uh, its range, and uh, its uh, Tenta Missile Special, and everything that I love about it, except for the Toxic Mist, basically. And it combines it with the Dually's mobility. So I'm super excited about that. And here you can see we've got... The Splatfest announcement, of course, which is ketchup versus mayo, but we know that's going to happen. Welcome to everybody coming to the stream. It's great to see you guys. I do like Pearl a lot better than Marina, but I also like ketchup a lot better than mayonnaise. Uh, <laughs> I'm actually allergic to mayonnaise, so definitely not a fan of it. So, uh, I don't know. I might have to side with ketchup here. Let me know what you guys think in the chat. I'm guessing that I'm guessing that ketchup is gonna win too. You basically take some fruit and mix it with sugar. Boom, jam. <laughs> Tomato is a fruit. Uh, that's that's gross. Why? Are, ugh. Why did you have to say that, Pearl? Is ketchup is ketchup jam, guys? Tell me, tell me in the chat. Is ketchup jam? Now I'm kind of grossed out. Here we have the beautiful Dooley Squelchers. 190 points required for the special, unfortunately. <laughs> I, love, I love how much Pearl hates Sheldon. Like she mentions it in everything. She mentioned that <laughs> she mentioned that ketchup is more boring than Sheldon. She just said, and now she's like complaining about listening to him talk. It's it's sad. I love Sheldon. He's the best. Ketchup is tomato jams. The soccer hero. Pokemans just says no. It's not convincing argument. Marjaston says ketchup is gooey tomato soup. Ketchup is a condiment. Says Aiden. Ketchup is jam. Says Ogaldover. Ketchup is a sandwich. Says Chen. Yeah, I agree. Ketchup is sauce, says Abby. Okay, all right. And then, of course, we have the stages. Ketchup ain't jam, says Angrio. Mm-hmm. Jorpin, great to see you. Oh, my God. Thanks for coming, Jorpin. Uh, check him out if you guys haven't already. He's on He's on the Twitch chat. You YouTube guys don't really know him. He does uh, lots of streaming, including Nintendo Versus titles that we know and love, so make sure to give him a follow, too. Jorpin's here to laugh at me as I feel with the Dooley Squelchers. Of course, Grizzco is still hiring, but th these weapons are kind of garbage. Uh, we have Heavy Splatling, uh, Roller, Blaster, and whatever. The stupid whatever, I don't know. Uh, Inkbrush. Yeah, Inkbrush is garbage in Salmon Run. Do not play the Salmon Run cycle. You will rank down. It is awful. <laughs> Wait until this next one, where we get Clash Blaster, Tri Slosher, uh, Splattershot Jr., and Charger. That's insane. This one is just trash. It's great to see you, everybody. Uh, Nazu is on Team Ketchup. Ooh, I like seeing the uh, preparations in the plaza here. I didn't play the Splatfest demo because I had the full game, so I don't know what the Splatfest stuff looks like. We have, oh, we have, like, some, uh, are these postcards or what? That's kind of cute, little souvenirs. Then, of course, the registration stand. Pick a side. Do we go mayo or ketchup? Uh, I saw Nazu is on Team Ketchup. Said I'll like catch up his life or something. So let's go. Nice. Whoa, Nazo did some fancy message thing. I don't know how he did that. You join the team, enjoy your Splatfest tea, but you gotta return it after the fest. I've never gotten that. I guess because they get the special double ability now. Uh are people gonna be using that in ranked? Like is that is that the meta now since you can equip that before uh Connecting to the internet, blah blah blah. Before the actual, uh, I lost my train of thought. Splatfest begins. You can equip this shirt with the double abilities. Is that going to be the meta? Get like getting a really good roll on your Splatfest tee. I feel like it will be. Cause I mean, if you get a good triple roll here, you can rock that in ranked. That would be crazy. That would be really crazy. Then check this. Check this. Doubles the effect of other abilities. That's why it's going to be the meta here. I like the the wristband is really cute. Like you're at a festival. That's that's really cute. I love that. Kind of want to level up my Splatfest T here since we'll be in uh, Turf War. Welcome to the stream, uh, Mayao. 
He says, good to see you streaming. I was worried you wouldn't realize the time wasn't 4 a.m. CT. Yeah, I don't know why that guy tweeted that. Uh, usually, I forget who it was, but he's somebody that tweets, like, uh, good info about stuff, and I guess he wasn't correct then. Sorry for misinforming anybody. Oh my god, stop. <laughs> uh, so we're going to buy the Dually Squelchers from Sheldon. It's great to see you, Marsha. Marsha says, okay, I haven't seen a Leafy stream in so long. Well, now you're seeing this one, and this one is so exciting. Yeah, I know, Squibby, you can't take the shirt after the Splatfest, but you can use it before the Splatfest all throughout uh, this week. Got a crazy good roll on it. You're ready to wheel the Dually Squelchers. Let's go. The Dually Squelchers are Dually versions of the Jet Squelcher. Never would have guessed. They feature an exceptional combination of highly accurate, rapid fire after rolling with long-ish range. Ish. You can pinpoint your opponent's positions with the point sensor, that's a mouthful, and Tenta missiles, making you a real nuisance to the enemy team. e dually 4 k says Genjamin, please no. And you can dodge roll away from opponents who get close. I recommend them for nimble fighters who want to support their team. I like playing support here. So, uh, let's pick this up. Equip it, of course. Those look stylish. I love that. And then, uh, let's head into the testing range real quick. Josh asks, where's my dual squelcher? This is them. They've been repurposed. Oh, I like the orange ink. That's kind of cool. Whoa, what the heck? You walk very fast compared to the jet squelcher. That is the first thing that I noticed. Your walk speed while shooting is enormous. I can see uh, run speed being really good on these. Because I don't even have my run speed shirt on right now, and I'm walking faster than I do with run speed on Jet Squelcher. Like, if we compare that to... Let's go favorites. Or just special. Look at that. That is so slow. But then we check out the, um... Okay. I guess we should sort by special. And then we check out the Dually Squelchers. Look at that! You're so fast! You're really fast. Bambooza Dually says, uh, uh, Angrio. I like that. So let's compare the range real quick. Let's, uh, let's reset the view here. Uh, move, stand exactly forward, and shoot. Okay. And then we'll compare that to the Jet Squelcher. Hmm, trying to line up perfectly here. All right. So we can see we have one, two, three, four, five. So it's like 20% less range. However, let's see how many shots it takes to kill. One, two, three. Still four shots to kill, and it's still the same damage if I'm correct. Uh, no, it's slightly less damage. Okay. But it's still four shots to kill. And now let's test out the long-awaited, uh... Roll. Feels slower compared to the uh, dualies, which I heard some people observed. Yeah. So it's slower, but I think it's longer. If we check out the dualies roll, that is exactly one unit. We check out the dually squelchers roll. Oh, no, wait, it is, it, it is exactly one unit. It just feels longer because it's a... Uh, I think it's a little slower. Hmm, you can chain it pretty well, though. Missy says, same range as the 96 gal. Okay, that's a good uh, reference there. So it doesn't have the range that I love the Jet Squelcher for. I do like a long-range weapon with a tumble, though. I really like that. This is pretty sick. Hmm... Linkable says, today is busy for you, huh? Great to see you, Linkable, and yeah, today's very busy. Will I be, uh, putting aside the Jet Squelcher to use the Dually Squelchers? I'm not entirely sure. I like this, but see, it's not as long-ranged as I would like. I like the Jet Squelcher's range, that's why I use it. But hey, let's, uh... Let's take this into Turf War first, a couple rounds, and then we'll try a couple rounds of Ranked. See how it goes. Yeah, we need less than 300 subscribers to get to 10,000. Uh, it'll be super, super fun. So make sure to subscribe if you haven't already, if you're enjoying this stream. Because I'll love to get to 10,000. That'll be pretty fun. 
Why am I here, asked Juan Lopez? Because you want to see the new Splatoon 2 update, of course. <laughs> Death Squelcher is one of your favorites, asked Jacob. Yes, it is. He says, mine is two along with the Splat Charger. Oh, wow. I'm no good with chargers. So let's, let's do this. Uh, okay, what ability do we want? On... No, I'll do that later. I don't want to bother with ability rolls right now. Let's just do some turf war. Welcome to the stream, G. It's great to see you. David says, I am so excited. Yeah, I am so excited. These, these just look cool. I love them. How do I complete Sheldon's research as video game master? He tells you in the second sector when you begin it. So you probably haven't played that much of hero mode, if I had to guess. Um... You just complete every stage uh, with one weapon. Subaru, welcome. Rick, thank you so much. He says, I just subscribed. If any of you subscribe and I missed the alert because I probably will since I'm playing the game, let me know in the chat so I can give you a nice little shout out. All right, let's go, guys. Does everybody have dually sculptures? No, just uh, me and one other guy. I wonder what level you unlock them at then, because I would have figured everyone would be using them. Because Inkbrush, not everyone was using it because just, you know, it's Inkbrush, we already know it, we already don't love it. Where is this guy? This is pretty fun. I haven't used the dualies much, so... Still, uh, I'm not exactly used to knowing how to use the Dooley's Tumble well. Oh, I probably should have used it there. Just subscribe to Spheros. Thank you. Or Fyros. So I'm guessing you like the Dooley Squelchers, asked Yoshimon. Uh, well, I haven't really used them yet. I think they're fun. Range is nice. It's still a four-hit kill, though, so... Does it kill in less time than the Jet Squelcher? Probably. When you're in attack stance. So that's nice at least. But it doesn't have the range. It has quite a bit less, in fact. And I'm really bad with them, by the way. Welcome, Jay Awesomeness. Sandra says, I believe in you, Leafy. You got this. Well, thank you. I appreciate it. But we're only playing Turf War, so... <laughs> Maybe uh, I wouldn't stress too much about me winning this. I'm just trying to get the hang of how to use them. Oh wow, Mega Taco says, hey, I'm getting a new PC tomorrow, because my laptop got fried. Hype. Ooh, that's really exciting. Not the laptop frying part, but the new PC thing. What was remaining in uh, Splatoon 1, asks Angrio. The 96-gallon deco. It had Splashwall and Kraken. It was basically just incredibly cheap. Oh, hello. Got him. Easy. Easy. Welcome Cable on YouTube, he says, I'm new to the stream and just subscribed. Thank you so much. Kind of embarrassing myself here with my poor, uh, Dooley Squelchers play. But they're fun. I'm liking them. <laughs> I'm just tumbling to my death here. Yeah, the stream might be a little laggy. My internet's been acting weird today, and I'm not entirely sure why. Sorry if it is lagging. It isn't usually like this. Not really much I can do about it, though. So if you complain, you'll be timed out, because you're just spamming. Try rolling backwards since you have some good range, says Arctic Frost. Yeah, maybe. That's a good suggestion. I don't have the same range as the Jet Squelcher, though. I have the same range as the Gallon. Will you play Mario & Luigi Superstar Saga plus Bowser's Minions, asked Jose. Yes, I will. Absolutely. Salmon Run weapons are horrible, says Exploding Bull. Uh, yes, they are. I agree. I'm loving Splatoon 2 Burrito King. It's really fun. Oh, speaking of loving Splatoon 2, uh, this product is provided by Nintendo. Just a little reminder. 
but that does not affect my opinion of it. Hey, Nazu PP joining us. Usually just call him Nazu, but that's his full name listed there. Um, thank you for joining us, Nazu. You guys can feel free to join me if you're on my friends list, and no, I will not be adding more friends because my list is full, unfortunately. Welcome, Blake. Thank you so much for subscribing. He says, I just subbed. I am secretly 5-star, though. Just trying to get you to 10k. Thank you so much. Oh my god, it's 5-star gaming, seriously? <laughs> I wouldn't advocate using alternate accounts, but thanks, I guess. Welcome, Craze Potato Man. It's great to see you. Duck Smoke says, Hi, Leafy. Just subbed. Thank you. I'm hoping that the hype of this stream could help, help drive us to 10k by, the, by tomorrow, or at least by the end of tomorrow. That'll be super fun. We'll have an extra special stream for that. It'll be really long and we'll play games together. Really utilizing the role there, as you can see. I kind of stood still and shot him. Oh, can't catch me. Yeah, that's what I thought. Gotcha, Nazu. <laughs> Yeah, I probably should have gone into attack stance there, but I didn't. It's okay if I taunt Nazu, because I know him. Welcome, Apple Arcade. Just subscribed, thank you so much. What's your favorite food? I want to know, asks Mega Taco Gaming. Oh, uh, rice. It's most of what I eat. This is just fun. I just, this is just so fun. Even if I'm bad with it. Got splatted by the end zap, dang it. 200 more, says Burrito King. Awesome. David Perez says, this is a thing. Yeah, it, it is. Uh, the Dooley Squelchers. Pretty, pretty interesting. It's a combination of the Jet Squelcher and, or rather the Dual Squelcher, I suppose, and uh, the Dooleys. Ooh, got Josh at least. How do I feel about the Dooley Squelchers so far, asks Zare. Um, I'm enjoying them. I think they're really good. I like that they're a longer ranged uh, dualies. I think that makes them super powerful. I'm just not very good with them yet. I would say out of all the dualies options, they're probably the most powerful. Due to their not awful range. Uh, four hits to kill is still a little lackluster. Linkable says sub and special are pretty lackluster, to be honest. No way. Tenta missiles are one of the best uh, uh, specials in the game, hands down. Uh, now the special point sensor, certainly... They purposely put that on there just to nerf it. Definitely not the best sub. But, uh, Titan Missiles I'm super happy with. Come on, Josh, let's go, let's go! Booyah, booyah! Bring your thumb down and give your boy a booyah! <laughs> okay. As you can see, I'm very good with these things. Oh yeah. What do you think of the new salmon run weapons? Asks Zesty. I think they're awful. We've had much better loadouts. Oh yeah. Dude, Dooley's pro. Ah man. And before they had roller dually, says Astral. I retweeted a picture somebody made of, uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> it was, uh, dynamo duallys, and it's, like, this guy holding two, two dynamo rollers in his hands. It was really silly. Favorite color, asks Sandra? Uh, like, pastel green? How do you get the Splatfest T? You have to, uh, you have to vote at the booth, Domo. Scroll back to the beginning of the video, because I demonstrate it. Hang on, let me restart the stream. I might. Uh, this could be better. Maybe. Or it might not be. It might be worse. We'll see. I tried switching the server that I'm streaming through. <laughs> oh, 
Okay, so we have two Dually Squelchers per team now. People are starting to buy it. I like it. I'm hoping we can get a quadruple Dually Squelcher game in. Think about Slosher Duallys. Oh, God. Hmm. Uh-oh. Bam. Oh, no. These things look like drills. I know, right? They look like power drills. Which sort of makes sense, since the uh, squelcher weapons are based on, like, uh, power washers. Got you, Nazu. I think Nazu got the dually squelchers now. Oh no! <laughs> I ran out of ink! Ink me up inside, man. Yeah, when you dodge roll, you combine them to form the dual squelcher. It looks really cool. It's hard to capture, but it looks really neat. Uh, Nintendo sort of got, like, special, you know, developer camera tools. To get a good angle of it. Nice! Really using that dually roll there. Slam! I love the thumbnail, says Astro Octo. Thank you. I kind of whipped it up in literally a minute in Photoshop. So I'm glad it's okay. Welcome, get hacked, he asks. Hi, Leafy, how late am I? Uh, 36 minutes late. Turn on notifications so you aren't late anymore. I don't, I'm not saying that as like an insult or anything. But, uh, it helps. Because now that we know, updates launch at exactly 9 p.m. Central Time. We'll be doing this every week. At exactly this time. Because Splatoon will have weekly updates, if I'm correct. Of course, with uh, next week's 9 p.m. update being uh, Splatfest. So if it's just Splatfest, we might not have a stream then. What am I doing? What am I doing? What is the better dually, original or the one with the curling bomb? Uh, original. I don't like curling bomb and I don't really like inkjet. I much prefer uh, splash, no, burst, sorry, and uh, penta missiles. I think that's a wicked loadout. Welcome, Brittany. Welcome, Moderator Angry. Says, hey, Leafy, do you think Splatoon 2 feels like Splatoon 1.5 or a proper sequel? Proper sequel overhauls so many mechanics. Uh, so many things are new, redone. Nothing is recycled. All the assets are made from the ground up, actually. Like, even the, all of the clothes from the first Splatoon are remade completely. Dually Squelchers, yeah, Le uh, Lyoko G. It's very exciting. I love the name Dually Squelchers because it's like the Dual Squelcher, but Duallys. Marina or Pearl, a lot of people are asking. Controversial opinion here, Pearl. Hey, J12 Cone. Like clockwork. Linkable joining us too with the Octobrush. Come on, come on, Linkable. You gotta fit with the theme here. We're trying to get a quadruple Dually Squelcher team going. We need four Dually Squelchers on one team. Come on, let's go. You gotta, you gotta work with the program, all right? Okay, we got Thon. Thon, maybe? Is the H silent? I like that, I like chaining the double. <laughs> We're all clueless. <laughs> no one was hitting each other. Oh, J12 Cone was in the last two games. I completely missed that. I don't really pay attention to the names. Oh, G12 Cone got uh, some sick abilities here. Let's see. Um. Hmm. Like to try and get ink. Uh. Oh, I gotta remember. I can't jump anymore while shooting, unless I let go of the stick like that. Oh my god. More range, less DPS? No, it's actually the opposite. Less range, more DPS, because you get the attack stance. You only get the uh, .92 gallon uh, range. 
Oh, Paisano says here from Nintendo K. Thank you guys for the little raid here. Really appreciate it. Uh oh. Who goes there? Have the point sensor now, which is pretty handy. I mean, it's no, it's no ink. Uh, toxic mist. Toxic Mist is basically point sensor. It lets you know where people are because they glow. That was stupid. Do you think the brush is good? Which brush, Bull? Ink brush, I don't think is good. Octo brush, I think is great. Ooh. I'm not good with dually squelchers, that's for sure. You are a boss, says Brittany. Thank you. Uh... <laughs> I tried to be with the Dually Squatchers, but it's not really working out here. I'd like to get a few Turf War games under my belt before trying them out in rank, though. For obvious reasons. Mainly because I don't want to mess up my teammates. Silver says, It seems Pearl is getting loads of hate. I think you explained this already, but what do you think of Pearl? I love Pearl. She's my favorite. I think Marina's cool because she's an Octoling. But once you really start playing the game, paying attention to the dialogue, you, you just gotta love Pearl, man. You play any other games on here as Firewolf? Yep, I play uh, lots, mostly Nintendo games. We're gonna be covering uh, Mario and Rabbids soon, ARMS, uh, Pokken. I'll be playing Blue Reflection in late September. I'll be streaming that. Uh, that's not a Nintendo game. Uh, Mario Odyssey, and then Fire Emblem Warriors, and Yokai Watch 2 Psychic Specters, and Xenoblade. That's like the general overview of the things I plan on covering. But I'll probably find some other things to stream too. Uh, like Blue Reflection, just general games that are interesting that you guys want to see. You play every day, yes. We do daily Splatoon live streams, so. If you're interested in that, make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss them. We play ranked, we play matches with viewers, we play Salmon Run. Really exciting. Just exciting stuff. To me, at least. One hundred seventy more subscribers until th uh, ten thousand. Wow, that's crazy. Booyah! We have Santi. Thanks for joining us, Santi. Santi usually sleeps through the streams <laughs> and then comments later, Oh my god, I was sleeping. I missed the stream. So I guess it's way too late for Santi to be napping. Glad he could join us. We have the triple Dually Squelcher team. We've almost reached the, the dream here. We have five out of eight people playing Dually Squelchers. Ah! <laughs> I was out duallyed. <laughs> that was tough. That was, uh, Nazu right there. Yeah, I agree. Lambda says that feeling you want the bonus from Salmon Run, but the weapons are trash. It's gonna be tough. For sure. Uh-oh. Who goes there? Oh, and I'm out of ink. Not a huge fan of Point Sensor. What time is it there? It's, uh, 9.45 p.m. Oh, oops. Welcome, Nintendo Kate. It's great to see you. Kendo say, Kate says, thanks for coming into the stream earlier and playing with us. Yes, of course, my pleasure. Uh, my friends, Nintendo Kate, there were streaming Salmon Run earlier, so of course I had to stop it and play with them. To that person asking if I ever play with any other YouTubers, yeah, I have a video up of me playing with Proxens and Nintendo Kate, two friends of mine. Uh, so you can check that out. Yes, I will be covering Superstar Saga and Bowser's Minions. That looks like a really fun game, Angel. Do you point sensor? I wonder which weapon threw that at me. Certainly not going to be the Splattershot Pro. Ugh. <laughs> I, keep, I keep rolling to my death. <laughs> Mayhem, great to see you again. Hello, Justin Williams. Sniping ass Leafy, do you, did you, or can you play Breath of the Wild? Yes, I did. I even made a video on it. I was going to make more, but then, uh, I don't know. Breath of the Wild just became, like, way too oversaturated on YouTube way too fast, and I felt like I just couldn't contribute anything to it. I don't know if you guys feel the same way. I felt like it got old before it even released. <laughs> uh, in terms of YouTube video coverage. 
And there was just a million view uh, videos out day one. So I made one boss guide video, and I was just kind of like, eh. I'm not really contributing anything here. And I only like to make videos when I feel like I'm contributing something cool. Live streams are different, because they're just me playing and having fun. Welcome, Kendall. Great to see you. David says, Leafy, thank you for the wonderful time. You're welcome. Thank you for coming. As you can see, I'm really focusing more on killing people than actually playing Turf War. <laughs> Angria says, hope you're doing well today, Leafy. Thank you, Angria. So we're going to try a little something to fix the stream here because I would like to fix it. So, uh, check something real quick. Let's see what we get. Our first ability, Ink Recovery, sweet! Double Ink Recovery there. I had two Ink Recovery subs on my normal shirt, so, uh, I'm satisfied with a single Ink Recovery there. Alright, so I do have an idea for an issue... That could be causing this. I use Restream to stream on uh, YouTube and Twitch at the same time. It could be the Restream server that is the issue. So, uh... Sorry, Twitch. Stream's gonna get the shutdown here. Um... And I'll, I'll just stream on YouTube right now and see what happens. Gonna cut out the stream for just a second and then we'll be back. Hey guys, the stream is back. Uh, hopefully it's good. If it is, then I found the solution to our problems. I might have to stop streaming on Twitch, which would just be unfortunate. Yeah, it seems like that's the issue. Uh, I'd rather not have YouTube lag, and... Oh, well, it seems like we actually did drop a few frames there, so... I think it's just my internet for tonight. I do apologize, guys. There's not really much that I can do about that, though. Thank you to everyone sticking with me for the uh, Dually Squelchers hype. Sorry that it's not the, uh, exactly the stream quality that you'd expect from, uh, our usual streams. Hopefully it's better tomorrow. Uh, let's see. I'll roll my way out there. Yeah, as you can see, I was kind of sorry to my teammates here. Since they're all people that I know, I figured it would be alright. What the heck? Dually Squelchers, says, uh, David. Yeah, Dually Squelchers. Pretty, uh, pretty crazy. Combination of Dual Squelcher and the Duallys. Hey, HD Hydra, great to see you. Thanks for coming. What about Sprat Brella, says Gray. Yeah, they're kind of, uh, kind of holding that, right? They know we want it, and they are not giving it to us yet. They're taunting us. As Sheldon says in uh, Hero Mode, he says, the newest weapon that everyone can't wait to try, or something like that, when he gives it to you. Thank you, D-Lane, for subscribing. Really appreciate it. Yeah, I think that the stream is working better now, so restream could be the issue. Uh, so might just stick to streaming on YouTube for now. They should create dually blasters, says Justin. Should is a very strong word here. Incredibly strong. How did we win that? I didn't, I didn't even play. How did we win that? <laughs> Nazu says, booyah. <laughs> Thanks for the carry, I guess. <laughs> I didn't even look at the scores. How did we win that? All right, let's, let's try a little tower control. See what happens. Why not roller in turf war, asks Abby. Because the dually squelchers just came out. Why, t why roller in turf war right now? I guess I'll ask that. Thank you, D-Lane, for subscribing. Thank you, Secure Hail, for subscribing. Glad that the stream quality is back. Thank you very, very much to everybody that stuck with me through that. Um, it never really occurred to me that that could be the issue because I was being stupid, I guess. Thank you, Seth with Connor, for subscribing. Uh, but now that we have that sorted out, we shouldn't have any stream issues from now on. Spread the word. Let people know that the stream is back online. Linkable asks, so can we call the Dually Squelchers a meme or good? Well, <laughs> we have du three Dually Squelchers in this match right now, so we'll see.
If I die, it's a meme. If I win, then uh, they're good. That's my logic. So far, I'm just being carried. Nice. Okay. So I beat uh, I beat the meme spray. Arrow meme. The, so they aren't total meme material. But uh, Dylan killed me, so maybe they are. They should make a bigger, slower splat umbrella, says Squibby. I mean, let's not get ahead of ourselves. They should make a splat umbrella first. Edgy kid number 57 with all the symbols in his name. That is a beautiful username. I love that. This guy's gonna carry us. Oh, dude. Double guns for killing two people at once? I love that. That's awesome. Let's see. Hey, Bazooka Frog, thanks for coming. It's great to see you again. He says, whenever I come up to a whenever I see a roller come up to me, all I can think is, hey, free real estate. <laughs> hey, let's reclaim this. Thanks. Can I maintain? Yeah, heck yeah. You can attack stance on top of a tower. You have to roll, like, into the middle post. And then you turret. That is sweet. I love that. Hey, get out of here. It's late for me, but I'm here, says Jack. You're just in time. We just started playing rank with the Dooley Squelcher. And we uh, fixed the stream quality. It's no longer lagging. Should I get a Nintendo Switch, asked Brittany. Absolutely. Every month, we're getting uh, new first-party titles on it. Definitely an expansive library compared to all the Wii U's. Oh, they knew I was there. Oops. HD Hydra asks, what do you think about the new duelies? They seem vastly different. I was hoping for a variation on the Jet Squelcher, but this is more like a variation on the duelies, if, if that makes sense. They're a longer range duelies, not really a Jet Squelcher ranged weapon with uh, a tumble. Hey, get back here. At least that's my take on them. Got you, Dylan. Here, let's uh, chase after Splatterscope guy. Up, oh, two, three, four. Where are these guys? Are they over there? Nah. Nice. I like the attack stance, it's good. No, it's bad, because they didn't kill him there. So obviously it's bad. Hey, we won, so it's good. We won, so, uh, the... Our sample size of one match... Means that the Dooley Squelchers are good. How many people have Hydra in their name? I do. As Hydra Pika. Wily Too Simple, thanks for subscribing. Nice, we won. I'm happy. <clears throat> you missed the dream, Leafy, says Nazu. Yeah, that's right. We did have the uh, quadruple duelies uh, in that last match, didn't we? That was awesome. <laughs> Lag says, wait, what? Dually Squelcher is my favorite weapon in the last game combined with my favorite weapon in this game? And it's already out? I need to grab my Switch. Yeah, this is it's a pretty sweet weapon. I'm liking it. Is this my new favorite weapon, asks Pedro. Uh, it's tough to say. I might like the Jet Squelcher more still. Uh, I, I like the big range on the Jet Squelcher, and the Dooley Squelchers just don't have that. But I think these are really good. Leafy, what is League Battle like? asks Santi. I couldn't tell you, I haven't played it yet. Ooh, nice! Double Slat with the attack stance there. And I- okay, yeah. As I said, not great with the duelies yet. Oh, okay. Ah, my mortal enemy, the Splattershot Pro. I wonder if there's a dually sniper, please no. Dually charger? Well, if you insist, Pineapple. When you say it like that, how could I refuse? Ooh. Ooh. 
out of here. Let's go. Ah, uh, let's... Okay. That was anticlimactic. JS says, Leafy, what did I miss? You missed uh, Turf War with Dually Squelchers. We even got a quadruple Dually Squelchers team going. But you did not miss Ranked. You missed a Ranked Knockout that we got, which is sweet. But we're still in action here. Playing some Tower Control with the Dually Squelchers. Double kill. Triple kill, maybe. I was hoping for it, but I lost him. I guess that's why he used the uh, Point Sensor. Ah, Still trying to get the hang of going into Attack Stance on the Tower. It's not exactly easy. I should heal up. Hmm. Scout ahead. Okay, we got missiles. Go for the double. Point sensor over there. Nice. Okay. Doing a pretty good job protecting my teammates. Nice. Okay. Ooh, the pro dodge rolls. Dude! I'm getting pretty good with these, I guess. That was pretty good. You guys see that? I hope so. That was, you gotta admit, those were some good rolls there. Some good jukes. Silver asks Leafy and Splatoon for Wii U, did you ever, ever have struggles with Turf Wars? Aw, oh, dude, the carry. No, I didn't. I just, uh, I just spammed arrow me. <laughs> what can we compare its range with? Does it have more range than the splatter shot? asks Lucas. Uh, I think so. It has the same range as the 96 gal, so... Whatever that is. What third parties are you excited for? asks Cooper Samurai. Uh, I need to get Disgaea 5. I haven't gotten that yet. Uh... That's like the big one. I'm excited for... Mm, I'm trying to remember. I need to get Cave Story Plus because it's getting the cooperative uh, update and the classic graphics update this August. Mm, I don't know. Probably Dragon Quest if that's coming. We don't know. We know Dragon Quest is coming in some form, but we don't know which versions they're localizing. I'm excited for Shin Megami Tensei for sure. If Persona Q2 is on Switch, then I'll be excited for that as well. Let's see. How does the new weapon work, and is it good? I think so. It's it's a long-range duelies, basically. Nice, Blaster. Favorite indie Switch game so far? Uh, I haven't played a lot of them, but I'm loving the... Or I loved, I finished it. The Wonder Boy the Dragon's Trap remake. It's absolutely beautiful. Completely faithful, but with just... Incredible new artwork and music. It's it's just such a beautiful game. You gotta play it. That's my most recommended third party game. Dude, awesome. Rapid Blaster and Tower Control. So much fun. Oh, uh, where are they? All right, Blaster. Nice. Wow, Ethan, I'm so proud of you. You killed me using one of the most least skilled weapons in the entire game. You really, you were really deserving of that taunt right there. Thanks for wasting time for your team and letting my team continue taking the tower. I genuinely appreciate that. I'm not being sarcastic. I, I'm really happy you did that. Oh, whoa, what? Linkable says, oh shoot, Leafy, you can grind out ability chunks with these t-shirts. They only cost 2,000 coins to scrub a dub-dub. Oh, that is awesome. Uh, I mean, my issue is that money doesn't even mean anything in this game, because by the time that you uh, grind your equipment back up to three slots filled, um, you'll have made 20,000 cash if you're just, it just, that's how it works. So it doesn't really matter. Like, cash has no meaning in this game, really. Because you can't pay for rerolls and slots. Awesome! David says, just want to stop in and then head out. Also, you've earned a new subscriber. Thank you so much, David. Really appreciate it. Most hated salmon run boss, asks Bull. Uh, probably... No, definitely the flyfish. Flyfish hate that thing, says Lucas. I agree. 
Roblox versus Lego Splatfest. Oh my god. Abby says, you know you can change music by pressing buttons and moving the sticks in the final game screen. Of course I do. I just don't do it that often, because I hate the music. Favorite Paper Mario game, asked Crimson. That is not even a question. Thousand Year Door. Does, just, I feel like that should be just given. Best Paper Mario game. Though, uh, sarcasm aside, I do of course love 64 and Super Paper Mario. Controversial opinion. Um, I, you know what's really sad? They only made three Paper Mario games. Really disappointing. Like, sure, Super Paper Mario was different, but it was still Paper Mario stylistically. Had interesting characters, story, funny dialogue. I was just so sad they never made it a, a fourth Paper Mario game. Would have been nice to see one on 3DS or Wii U, you know? Hopefully they make one for Switch. Oh, nah. Thought I could get out of there. How do you have a Splatfest TS, Bearcat? Uh, scroll back to the beginning of the video. You gotta vote. Stop Disapply. <laughs> Disapply says bone pizza versus boneless pizza. <laughs> this meme has gone too far. Oh no. Would you play Dragon Ball Fighters if it came for came to the Switch? I retweet like every single petition for that thing because Bomco said that they'd put it on Switch but only if people show interest. So anytime that I see a big like thing that's like, retweet if you want to show Bomco that you have interest. I'm like, hey, yeah, ar armchair activism for game localization. I, w I really want to buy it, like, honestly. I would so play that. I'd play, uh, it would never happen, but if they put Persona 5 Arena on Switch, I'd totally get that. I'll get it on PS4 if they don't. Of course. And I'll probably, uh, I'll probably stream that. Garcella asks, what is the boneless pizza meme anyway? I don't know. I don't know. I don't understand it. It's one of those memes that I don't understand where it came from, so I just don't find it funny. It's just, like, legitimately annoying. <laughs> Not sure if there are memes like that for you guys. Can't catch me. Or maybe you can. Spaghetti versus toast, says Matthias. Uh, I don't... I don't understand that. <laughs> but, uh, it could be fun. What am I doing right now? That was the most pathetic swim that I've ever seen. But hey, we got the lead, no thanks to me. Ah, oh, dang it. What am I doing right now? Can you do the Nogami combo? No! Definitely not. Oops. Let's see. Um Hey, roller, come back here, thanks. Red Joy-Con versus Blue Joy-Con? Oh my god. That'll be the best Splatfest Crimson. They need to make that. That should have been like the first Splatfest. Or, or, either that or Neon Switch versus Gray Switch. Because that's the most divisive topic among Switch owners. Neon Switch versus Gray Switch. Obviously Neon. Dude, Bucket, my favorite. It is the top of the hour, that is true. Uh, so just a reminder, this product is provided by Nintendo. Thank you guys for that. Uh, love you guys. What are the dually squelchers, asked Marina? Watch and see. They're long-range duallys, basically. They're not exactly jet squelchers, and I'm doing awfully with them today. Nope. No thanks. Hey, hey. I said no thanks. 
can't kill me, that's against the rules. Uh-oh, what's this guy up to? Do not let them... Don't. Just don't. Don't let them clutch it out. They're gonna, because we got aced. <gasps> Are you kidding me? Seriously? Oh my god. Oh my god. I completely threw that. That was absolutely pathetic. That was the most embarrassing game of my entire life. Alright, we'll go one more ranked match, and then we'll do a few more turf wars. Do I think there will be new colors in future updates, asks uh, JS? No, I don't think so. Judd versus Little Judge Splatfest? That would be really fun. That's a cute idea. <laughs> Your reactions are priceless, says Abby. I get very excited when playing games. I don't get upset, but I get very excited about them. And I get very into them. That boy here says, Oh my god, I was in the stream. I was Galaxy Spy. Oh wow! What were you playing? What weapon? Let's take the side route here. Leafy, do the juke, says Marsha. Yeah, I didn't juke enough that time. That's the key. Splash of Dooley's update 1. Great to see you, Captain Falcon. Oh, nice. I juked myself. I juked myself. I can't afford the new gun, says Panda. It costs like 10,000. Just play a few Turf Wars. Alright, let's try this again. Uh, we're gonna need to try that a third time. Inkling Boy versus Inkling Girl Splatfest? That would be kinda cool. Oh no. Uh. Jukes? J Jukes? Jukes. Yeah, I got you, Galaxy Spy. He's watching the stream right now. Oh no. What's he using? Uh, Dually Squelchers, I think? Okay, duh! Just as I say okay. At this point, why am I even on the tower? Triple! Worth it. I thought that guy was dead, honestly. Not even gonna lie there. Retro versus new. Let's see. How can I actually be useful to my teammates instead of whatever I've been doing? There we go. Splatting Peter again. I always go for the bucket boys. I hate them. Jukes. Dude, th these things are so fun. I don't even care if I'm bad with them. They're so fun. It's ridiculous. Yes! Told you, you gotta go for the buckets. I hate them. <laughs> what was even going on there? Why didn't I just turn on him? Inklings versus Octolings Flatfest? I'd love to see that with playable Octolings, dude. I think everyone would. What sensitivities do you use? Uh, negative 3 for motion and negative 1 for stick? It's a good question. Oh, thanks, Galaxy. Dual rollers, please no. Life versus death? Oh jeez. <laughs> that sounds morbid. Well, we got the knockout. No thanks to me. 
Well, I did some work on that, uh, the last push there. Second to last push, I suppose. How many kills did I get? Six? Oh, yeah. Thanks, Jim, for the carry. Much appreciated. Nice. We'll play till we lose, and then we'll do some uh, turf wars. Motion controls versus analog? Yes, Beth, I agree. That is a great idea. Bearcat asks, what's wrong with Twitch? Uh, it makes us lag, so we aren't doing it anymore. <laughs> David says, my mom told me to sleep, but my excuse is I'm watching Leafy. I I'm honored, David. That's awesome. Thanks for, uh, thanks for tuning in. Lama asks, Leafy, what do you have your sensitivity settings on? Go back like a minute or two in the video, because I just went over that. Let's go. Uh, this way. What do we have? We have Jet Squelcher, Dually Squelchers, Duallys, and Splattershot. I was hoping for a, a meme team here with like quadruple duallys. That'll be kind of hype. Mm. Why would I do that? Hey, get out of here. My tower. It's called tower control for a reason. It's not tower concede. Hmm. Where are they? Oh, can we do this? Nah. Almost, almost. How do you use an amiibo in Splatoon 2? You scan it uh, in the back of the plaza? And, uh, then you play some games, and then you scan it again, and then you play a few more games, and you keep doing that until you get a Squid Beat song. And that's the final reward. You can also score, store gear and stuff, but I assume you know how to do that. Nice. I knew him pretty well this time. Let's go! Nice. Knockout. Death Madness says, when my mom walks in my room, I say, Mom, get out of my room, I'm watching Leafy. I'm honored. <laughs> Thank you, guys. It, it means so much to me that so many of you guys watch. It's really fun. Uh, it's awesome, because I love playing games. I love talking with people. So streaming is just kind of a natural extension of that. I love playing games while talking with you guys. You guys are great. Koopa Samurai, thanks for tuning in. It's great to have you. Zach says, level 10 unlocks everything from the amiibo. That is false. That is false. Um, you need to play matches after scanning the amiibo. It, your level does not matter. What level do you need to be to buy Dually Squelchers? I would love to know that. Uh, I'm level 38, so I have everything unlocked instantly. Oh, I didn't see my stats for that one, but I'm guessing they were really good. J12 Clone says, I'm in love with this new weapon, Leafy. Yeah, I am too, dude. It's super fun. I think it's really good. Level 12, says Mario. Alright, guys, there you have it. You unlock the Dooley Squelchers at level 12. Thank you, Mario, bro. Ah. <sighs> If I could be useful here, that would be nice. Let's claim the tower at least. Kill him? Nah. Got splatted by the splatter shot. I'm level 16 and I had it unlocked, says Aiden. Okay, so yeah, I guess 12 checks out. <laughs> I 
<laughs> Bio says, when my mom walks in my room while I'm watching streams, I say, Mom, why aren't you at your own house? <laughs> okay, let's get this. Why are we doing so poorly today? Is it because Leafy's on our team? Come on, dude. Team too heavy. Can't carry. Ah, oh, why would I do that? Why aren't I juking? Which weapons design do I like the most? Asks uh, Mal. That's a really good question. I would say uh, either the Octo Shot or um, the Arrow Spray. I am a huge fan of Splatoon lore and stuff. Or the Bamboozler, yeah, Bamboozler. I'm a huge fan of Splatoon lore, so I love that they have a replica of the weapon that they use the most in. Uh, that was used the most by the Inklings in the Great Turf War. I thought that was a super cool idea. I'm not very good with the Bamboozler, and I don't think that the Bamboozler is very good at being good, but uh, it's still very cool. I'm not very good with these either, in case you couldn't tell. Bearcat asks, what's your opinion on the Splatoon anime that got announced in Japan? My opinion is that it's a Splatoon anime that got announced for Japan. We know literally nothing else besides the fact that it's based on the Koto Koto manga, but we don't know how much, uh, so I can't really have an opinion yet. <laughs> Scooby says, I love when Sleepy is sarcastic, but some people take it seriously. Yeah, we got like 10 different people thinking that they're smarter than me, commenting that, uh, Leafy, there were, there were Paper Mario games on 3DS and Wii U, and I'm like, thanks for explaining the joke, guys. Thanks. Appreciate it. Uh, but, you know, that, that just kind of happens when I'm sarcastic. Marina says, whenever my mom is, walks in my room while I'm watching a stream, I just scream. And I just imagine you, like, hissing at her when she walks in. She's like, hey, you haven't come out for eight hours. Are you, are you hungry? Do you need anything? <laughs> mom, leave me alone. <laughs> Bearcat says, sorry, Leafy. No, don't be sorry. I was just explaining my thoughts on the anime. Uh, it's too early. Like, we don't even have a screenshot or anything. We don't know how it looks. I've been wanting a Splatoon anime for so long, but I want a serious one. I want one based on hero mode. Nazu says, Bamboozler is super good in the right hands. I mean, anything is. Uh, but yeah, Bamboozler is kind of tricky. <laughs> Zach says, you're honestly so funny, Leafy. Thanks, Zach. I don't really try, but uh, I have fun, and I guess that people pick up on that. Santi asks, what was your mom like, Leafy? What, she's not dead. Don't say was. <laughs> she's really nice. Really supportive. Uh, she's great. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just kind of diving on the tower. These, these sloped stages are just... I hate them. Captain Falcon asks, do you like Super Paper Mario on the Wii? I've been meaning to make a video for the longest time about this, but in my opinion, Paper Mario games are not genres, they're styles. So, Super Paper Mario, a lot of people say, is not a Paper Mario game because it's not turn-based RPG, right? But I believe that it is a Paper Mario game because it has, um, it has the unique writing, the unique characters, the worlds, um, the humor, everything that makes Paper Mario Paper Mario instead of Mario & Luigi RPG. Though Mario & Luigi RPG, uh, the old ones, do sort of share those qualities as well. Um, Meanwhile, Sticker Star and Color Splash just obviously don't have that, uh, even though they're turn-based RPGs. So, in my opinion, Paper Mario is a style, a style in writing, a style in atmosphere, a style in design. It's not the actual gameplay that makes Paper Mario Paper Mario. At least to me. So yes, I do absolutely love Super Paper Mario. I think it's wonderfully written, uh, expertly designed. And it's one of my favorite Wii games of all time. We're going to play a couple more Turf Wars here. Abby says, when my mom walks in while I'm seeing a stream, she joins in. Oh, that's so sweet. Jake says, your team seems to be changing the objectives. Instead of focusing on watch the tower, get picks off the other team and make sure they don't touch that tower. Yeah, that's a good idea. I'd do that if I was good. Thank you, I'll keep that in mind. <laughs> 
Leafy just joined the stream, says Claudio. Great to see you again, Claudio. QRabinX says, The only Paper Mario game that I've played is Thousand Year Door. That's all you need to. Uh, 64 and Super Paper Mario are incredible games as well, but Thousand Year Door is the best by far. One of my favorite games of all time. Uh, probably my second favorite game of all time, to be more specific, right behind Pikmin 2, of course. In case you couldn't tell from the stream alerts, I really like Pikmin. I should have tried and juked, but I had that truck, so, eh. <laughs> Mel says, when you hissed, my cat meowed, so I guess he says hi. Hey, Mel's cat. <laughs> oh, jeez, what am I doing? Jada says, love your videos. Thank you, Jada. I should remember that I'm playing Turf War right now. Not trying to pick people off and actually be useful. Let's see... Mm, let's go for the double. What's next? The Roller Charger Dualies. No, no, no. We need the Jet Squelcher Scope. That's what we need. You zoom in while you're firing. No! No! Ugh. Oh man. I got double teamed. I would've totally beaten the uh, Carbon Roller. Would've kited him. What's my favorite Salmon S, uh, Giri Lock? I would say... Uh... I think Flyfish has a really cool design, but I hate fighting it. Probably... Maybe the Goldie. I love the sounds that it makes and its animations and everything. Unique Turtle says, Hi there, how are you with Chargers in the first game? Utter trash. I never played them, so... Not good with them. Do you have a Trooper in Pikmin, asked Hydropeka. I don't know what that means. A Trooper. Explain. Just got a switch, says Sebastian. Should I buy Zelda or Splatoon? If you want a meaningful single-player experience, buy Zelda. If you want a solid single-player experience, but a short one, and an incredible and uh, lengthy multiplayer experience that will be updated for one year, and uh, have events for two years, all for free, then pick Splatoon. Both are completely different games, um, but I highly recommend buying both eventually. However, um... It's really up to you. Do you prefer multiplayer or single player? Should I buy Hey Pikmin or Miitopia? Asks, uh, I forget. Some, who? But somebody. Uh, Nintendo sent me both. Disclaimer. Product provided by Nintendo. And I still have yet to do my reviews on them. They should be coming in around a week. Sorry for that. Uh, I've had a lot on my plate. I would say Hey Pikmin, but I'm a massive Pikmin fan. Miitopia is a super solid game, though. It's really fun. Are you Splatoon 1 better in S Jinx? Yeah, I had around 250 hours in it. Probably more, honestly. I need to recheck that. I feel like that's an understatement, because I played it way more than that. But yeah, definitely a Splatoon 1 veteran. Huge fan of the original. Mega Duelies. Very powerful Duelies with decent range, but due to its weight, it can only roll once before becoming stationary, says Nock. That's an interesting idea. I like that. Favorite weapon, S. Albert. Uh, Jet Squelcher. Ravenac votes Metopia. Booyah, says Angria. I agree. Her forehead says Disapply. Whenever people mention Pearl's forehead, it always reminds me of Fooly Cooly. Um, <laughs> or they're like, those eyebrows. I don't know, it always reminds me of that. <laughs> Duly everything, says Am Amu. We should have, like, uh, a custom Splatoon mode that you can do in, uh, in custom matches only, where every weapon gets duly rolls. That would be really funny. This game has improved graphics, says Jai. Yeah, I mean, I kind of assume so. All assets are remade from the ground up. Nothing is ported from the Wii U version. Especially single player is beautiful. With the ink getting those pretty specs and stuff. Me ask Leafy, are you on a Splatoon competitive team? No, that's not really my thing. I prefer just uh, being by myself and doing stuff by myself, I guess. 
I'm not a huge, like, team, squad, uh, whatever, uh, I'm trying to remember the other cool kid name, uh, clan, clan guy. I guess the Splatoon team is sort of different, and I might be interested in that in the future, but I don't think I'm good enough if I'm being frank. Hydropika, no, I don't. I've played with him before, pre release, but we've never spoken. I follow him on Twitter if that counts. Oh, really nice shot, Linkable. Oh my god. That was intense. Welcome, Moderator Trev. Thanks for coming. Hmm. Do you think Pearl is your favorite or Marina as Jade? Pearl. Absolutely, by far. Oh my god. Welcome, Cake Appen. He says you can call me Cake. Thanks for coming. If you guys are enjoying the stream, please subscribe. Uh, well, subscribe if you want to, if you're enjoying it. If you aren't enjoying it, then, you know, be honest. Let me know how I can improve. I'm not going to say subscribe just to subscribe, but if you're enjoying it, then certainly do. We're almost at 10,000 subscribers, and it would make me really happy to reach that, because that would be incredible. That would mean that in the past two months, we've doubled in subscribers every month. From June, from May to June, we went from 2,500 to 5,000, and then from June to July, we'll have gone from 5,000 subscribers to 10,000 subscribers. And that's just insane to me. And that happened because of our ARMS coverage, and then our Splatoon 2 coverage. We'll have continued coverage of not only Nintendo games, but other titles as well. Um, with a sort of competitive, analytical spin on, uh, the, on the videos. Live streams, of course, I try to be competitive, but uh, first and foremost, I put the audience first. Uh, one big thing that when I'm watching streamers, of course I do like watching the gameplay, but... I see, not to like smack talk them or anything, because this is just a different style, I see they don't take a big advantage of the live medium. I like interacting with you guys, I like answering all of your questions, and I think that you guys ask some really good questions that spur me to uh, analyze things well. When you ask uh, how I feel about certain balancing, uh, I know that sometimes I like to say it's too early to say, but it does get me thinking. Um, when you ask about certain stages, or why did you make this play, uh, when you critique how I do, I think that I think that really helps, and I think that it helps add a sort of competitive spin to things. Um, not to like talk myself up, but since a lot of people are new, I figured that I'd explain my outlook. I'm working on a weapon analysis for the Dually Squelchers now that they're out. That will be out tomorrow, so be on the lookout for that. It will be a detailed analysis of my thoughts on them, and you can look forward to that um, in the future. Coming up for all of the weekly weapon updates, we'll be analyzing all of them. Um, so I'm really excited to do that. We'll be doing some stage analysis as well. Um, it's going to take a while, but I'm working on a huge salmon run guide with all of my thoughts on it. Uh, I'm trying to figure out exactly how I want to release it with all of the different weapon rotations and such. But yeah, that, that just gives you an idea of the Splatoon 2 content coming up for Mario and Rabbids will be the next game that we're covering. I'll be doing unit analysis on that, where I, I'll be going over what's the best skill trees to take, uh, who are the best units to take, and when. That, I feel like the game is going to have a lot of depth, since it's by uh, Ubisoft. So, uh, get excited for that. We'll be covering Pokemon Tournament, where we'll be doing another Race to the Top Rank Battle live stream. Uh, of course, I'll have... Uh, some technique videos outside of that as well, but we will of course be focusing on showing, showcasing competitive matches. I was pretty competitive early on in Pokémon, but then I kind of fell out of it because of time issues. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the stream. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. Turn on notifications so you don't miss a thing. Uh, and I will see you guys tomorrow with the Salmon Run live stream, viewer private battles, or no, let's not do Salmon Run. Let's just do rank battles, viewer private battles. And then we'll have Dooley Squelcher's weapon analysis. So I'll see you guys then. And uh, hope you can play together tomorrow evening.